You're watching a segment of The Splash, Greater West Bloomfield's news magazine show. A local gallery held a special exhibit featuring over 100 pieces of art from women painters. Reporter Jay Kustash brings us the story. I'm here visiting the Janice Carrot Gallery to take a look at the brand new exhibit put on by the Birmingham Society of Women Painters. Leslie Katinsky approached us about a year ago and she is the vice president of the Birmingham Women's Painters Society and we had a couple meetings with her and decided that this would be a great venue for the Painters Society and um, so we did, we did jury the show, all of the artists submitted and we sat down and we took um, artwork about probably about 100 pieces from 42 different artists. Mm -hmm. These pieces came together to form an exhibit they called Beyond Constraint. Well, we chose the name because actually we vote on it. Everybody okay. submitted names and we really liked it. And I think it expresses what our group feels, that as women, we um, go beyond the boundaries of what the norm is and we try to express it emotionally and figuratively mm -hmm. uh, for each artist. The Birmingham Society Women Painters provide support to local artists, helping with honing their skills and getting their work seen. The Birmingham Society of Women Painters mm -hmm. uh, is a group made up of all women mm -hmm. and it was started in 1944 because um, they wanted to educate and have a place for women who wanted to paint. Our group is made up of many women mm -hmm. of many different ages from all over the metropolitan area of okay. Detroit. Uh, we also are very interested in educating our people, okay. our members, and um, going to different workshops. Mm -hmm. We're always developing, um, and we always have a, a very special artist come in. That's mm -hmm. one of the things we do. Oh, okay. And talk about how they created mm -hmm. their art and how they developed to be an artist. Mm -hmm. It's a wonderful group of people. We do, we do about five or six shows a year, which some of them we curate, mm -hmm. some of them we put out a call for art where mm -hmm. people can apply to the show and we jury it, or we have outside curators that curate the show and oh. bring the artists in. We try to jury an artwork that is original in concept, mm -hmm. um, you know, crafted well, um, and also how it hangs in the space, and also how it kind of plays off of the other artwork. Leslie not only helps set up the show, she's also one of the featured artists. So this is market day, and usually when I do a painting, I use um, a photo that I've done myself. Okay. And I happened to be in Africa at the time, and this was uh, along the Zambezi River, and this was um, a little market when we got off the boat, mm -hmm. and this woman was there. And I usually have painted um, many portraits of all my grandchildren mm -hmm. and other pe for other people, and I decided that this painting, mm -hmm. this is for me. This exhibit helps with benefiting both artists and the culture of this community. Reporting for The Splash, I'm Jay Kustash. For more, you can visit civiccentertv.com slash beyond constraint. Thanks for watching a segment of The Splash. To catch the entire show or other segments, watch us on Comcast Channel 15 or AT&T Channel 99. Or look us up online at thesplash.tv and listen to us on WBLD 89.3, the all-new Lakes FM.